Okay, so I'm going to be diagramming a magnesium atom. And so, to start off, you'd get the average atomic mass, and you'd round that to the nearest whole number. So in this case, you'd round it, and it'd be 24. And then you take the amount of protons and subtract that from the rounded atomic mass. So 24 minus 12 equals 12. And so, because of that, that's the amount of neutrons that the nucleus has. So, there would be 12 neutrons in the nucleus and 12 protons in the nucleus. And then the amount of protons and neutrons or electrons are equal. So, you'd have 12 protons, so you'd have 12 electrons. And the way that the electrons are set up are that they go in rings. And so, they go in rings of 2, 8, 8, 2. And so, the first ring would be two electrons, the, the second ring would be eight electrons, then the third one would be two electrons. But it's a lot easier because the atom wants to have rounded rings, so it doesn't want to have two left over. And it's a lot easier to lose two electrons than it is to gain six. So it would lose two, and then it'd become magnesium with a positive two charge for because there are two more protons. Thanks.